More than 86% of Canadians donate to a charity every year. The average donation is $446. Collectively, we send $10 billion to charities and nonprofits each year. So good for us. But how do we know that our generous contributions are going to be used for good? Will my dollars be used to cure cancer? Or will it just fund a bunch of stupid yellow bracelets? Well, let's take a look at what is, by most measures, the most effective charity in Canada. This is the one that is best able to reduce human suffering per dollar received, the Against Malaria Foundation. Here's what they do. They buy and distribute mosquito nets. That's it. Nearly half a million people die of malaria every year. That's more than the entire Syrian civil war. Another 200 million people are sickened by it. That's a whole whack of people unable to work or go to school, which is why malaria consistently ranks as one of the main factors slowing African development. So, you give people nets to sleep under, they don't get malaria, and everyone's richer, healthier, and more alive. And here's the best part. Every dollar donated to Against Malaria goes exclusively towards nets. Not one cent of that dollar will be eaten up by administrative or fundraising costs. All of Against Malaria's overhead costs are covered by a group of British private donors and pro bono work from companies like PricewaterhouseCoopers. Against Malaria can do this because they run a really tight ship. Their website sucks, all their staff work from home, and again, their only job is to collect money, buy nets, and distribute those nets. There's no celebrity galas, no tote bags, no conferences, no call centers full of people bothering you at work for more money. The CEO, Rob Mather, doesn't take a salary. The result, Against Malaria, is really, really good at turning money into mosquito nets. Research by Charity Intelligence Canada shows that if you give $100 to Plan International, they can buy 12 nets. Give it to UNICEF and they can buy 27 nets. Give it to Against Malaria and they will buy and distribute 38 nets. Against Malaria is one of the world's greatest examples of what is called effective altruism. They found a major global problem with a relatively clear-cut solution and now they're just fixing that problem without getting distracted by all the usual frou-frou. Now, I'm not saying you should exclusively donate to Against Malaria. Mosquito nets aren't going to stop Ebola outbreaks, discover new treatments for osteosarcoma, or feed a struggling family in Thunder Bay. But feel free to approach your favorite charity on occasion and ask them, why aren't you guys more like Against Malaria?